amazing host and host and he's gonna have many more amazing people on his show yeah. and I just hope that you guys grow with him on his journey and you know we never know how big this is gonna get so yeah. let's just see where you take this take this juice to an oh 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 all right kale ke tuka mo le ke tuka mo le le dipino ke na le ngwa ga tsa tharo ke betsa comedy marapo video la me ke go felo ke batla go tshona le tempo ke batla go tshona khalefo ke spana ka tshata ke dindo 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 ya dindo ya dindo All right, 1043 is your time for yours truly. My name is TK and I appreciate you so much for tuning in. Gab City Beat Up Africa the rest of the world. You're amazing. Thank you so much for stopping by for returning subscribers. What it is? What it is? What it is? For the ones that are about to do their thing. Uh-huh. You know what? I see you. You're amazing for doing that. In the building this morning for this amazing brand new feature, what I call and what I dub celebrities and the music they like. I got Losto do the mosto Lorato Ora Peleng is in the building and in case you're wondering who is she TK I didn't know nothing about our girl who you got in the studio let me put you on game yo This one is a media personality of note influencer producer and founder of Media Rap Africa for your film and television production oh man it gets better radio production it gets juicier advert production and so much more but she's also by the pseudonym madam chop live i need you to put your hands together and a rousing round of applause it's got to be the thunderous the most thunderous rousing round of applause for my sister lusto Good morning. Good morning, TK. How's it? I'm good. How are you doing? I'm fantastic. I'm feeling great. Such a beautiful introduction. Thank you so much for putting it all in the bio. I was researching till 2 a.m. <laughs> love this. Love this. Clearly, it worked out. The man's got to work. I'm so, so happy that you're here. I've been seeing so much of you everywhere lately. Yeah. And I'm like, this girl is working. But for a lot of people that need to know so much more about what I've said in the intro... How would you introduce yourself? Um Lorato Rapeleng is an all-round media personality yeah. focusing on event hosting, television presenting yep. and producing like you've mentioned. Yep. And I'm a serial entrepreneur. A lot of people don't know the side of me, oh, but wow. I am into different um industries. I'm into hospitality, I'm also into mining, yeah. and as well as media as you've mentioned. So that's really round about who I really am. I love that. Yeah. So where did Madam Chop Life come from? Where did where did that come from? Madam Chop Life is a big story. <laughs> That's a big big story. Oh yeah, tell us so. Uh, please, can I start from the first day from when it when it started to begin? <laughs> <laughs> well, Madam Chop Life is a nickname that I was given by my friend, um, his partner at the time. Uh-huh. And it's only because I used to like going out so much. Ah. Literally, I'd come visit them in Joburg and yeah. I'd put my bags in the in a room and say, "Guys, Later. I'll see you guys tomorrow. And it's like, Losto, where are you going? And it's like, no, guys, there's a party somewhere. And it's like, Losto, you live in Botswana. Yeah. How do you know about everything that's happening in Joburg when Job- you don't even live here? Right, right, it's right. It's like, this is your friend of yours, please, baby. She's Madam Chop Life. <laughs> and then that was the end of it. So everybody started calling me Madam Chop Life. And I like the name. I embraced I it, it because that's the culture that I enjoyed living at the time. That's right. Yeah. You and I are about to enjoy the music that you love the most when you're driving, when you're taking a shower, when you're cooking, whatever it is. It's celebrities and the music they like. But let's get to know a little bit about you, personal stuff, right? Right? Yeah. Because I need to know, you know, who I'm really sitting down with. I've just been seeing you on social media. Mm-hmm. It's incredible. The last time you're at Afro Nation, you're yeah. popping. The yeah. next time you're in South Africa, it's popping. The other time you're in Tanzania. I haven't been to Tanzania, you haven't been to Tanzania yet. yet. <laughs> but it's about to happen. But for a lot of things that you say you are, how's yeah. that coming up for you? I mean for me right now I am currently enjoying working in versatile spaces like I've mentioned. Yeah. Um I normally like to move where the money is. That's the fact. Of yeah, I like to move with the money, but ultimately my passion does lie in film and television and television yeah. production and film production yeah. and becoming an influencer and creating content for people who do follow me on social media. Dope. Um at the moment I'm working on a very exclusive well in fact it's already here. Yeah. It's just a matter of me announcing it on Monday. I right, hope right. everybody's ready. This week it's going to be a big week. Dope. Um we're going to be announcing a beautiful collection that I've come up with that I've been working on over the past few years. Everybody's asked wow. me, "But I'm chopped like Lorna Raba, Karamata Hotel." So this is literally the time where I'm going to be giving um my followers and my fans a part of me. Yeah. So there's something that I'm going to be dropping this week and I hope everybody stays glued to my social media. It might be obvious for some, 
but it's the original Madam Top Life. That's why I'll leave it. I like that. I yeah. like that. At some point, I saw you introducing a brand new show. I'm not too sure if it's what you're talking about right now. No. Romantic relationships. If everyone is struggling with this and that, they could always call you and you could always try uh, provide transport, provide yeah. everything. <laughs> For as long as people are together, yes. then you can spark it So up. there is a brand new show that's coming up. Yeah. Um, I was just part of the production that was helping them with the, with the production of the show. Dope. Um, it's going to be coming up very soon on BTV. Amazing. Um, that's a story for another day. Yeah, but it's yeah. all about love. It's all about, you know, hopeless romantics. It's all about also people who'd like to fix their relationships. Ah, so yeah. that's what we have um, in, in, in stock for you guys. Where do you fall in? I am just a girl that does the influencer work. So technically, <laughs> I was influencer for the show. No, no, no. I mean, where do you fall in when you... <laughs> You mean like that? Are you are you are you struggling and you need help, or you're hopeless, romantic, you're looking for love, or you're sorted? I'm a lover girl, one, uh-huh. and at the moment, I am not looking to date a specific race, <laughs> <laughs> a specific tribe, a specific nation. But shame, um, I do love love. I think love is a very beautiful thing, and yeah. I wish everybody should be in love. I wonder who you're not trying to date. Which race? <laughs> which race? <laughs> Lostro, what's going on? No shame. I'm just joking. Um, I just think love is a beautiful thing. Like I'll keep repeating that. Oh yeah. yeah. Um, regardless of where you're from, who you're with, and all of that. But yeah. for me, at the moment, I am in the streets. Not in the streets. Yeah. In the process. In the- <laughs> <laughs> so you texty texty with someone right now? Late nights, fun calls, and all of that. Ooh, TK. Ooh, juicy, huh? TK. Okay. I don't want to spill the beans. The man might feel nervous now. <laughs> yeah. We don't want to chase him away. No, right? no, no, no. Because no. the last time you were in Ghana and you were at a restaurant and you saw some girls that were super, super salty about you and a guy. Oof. And then this guy told you that he's in a relationship and this lady seemed to have BBLs and they couldn't shake their butts. And- <laughs> you watched my story time, didn't you? <laughs> I was like, which one is this one? The one part that I actually super, super laughed up yeah. out, out, aloud, out loud on yeah. was when you say, <laughs> this is BBLs. Obviously, in your accent, in your, in your, yeah. you're like, these girls can't even shake their butts. Can I tell you? Tell me about that story, man. So I traveled to Ghana last year in December. It was yeah. my first time in West Africa. I think uh-huh. I've wanted to go to West Africa for the longest time. Right. And um, there is a part of me that is from Ghana. Mm-hmm. We'll get into that another day, another of course, time. Of course, yeah. But um, so I'm out, you know, I'm alone by myself. So I get into this um, beautiful, nice restaurant in Ghana. Yeah. And I see a couple of two guys by the door. I'm like, oh, listen, guys, I'm here by myself. Can yeah. I please join your table? I'll get yeah. my drinks, everything. The guy's like, no, sweetie, we're spending too much money. Please. <laughs> Lady, give her a tag. I'm Okay, I like the sound wow. of this. Yeah. So I get to their section. I don't know they have other people in their section, and I get there, and it's just a bunch of mean, mugging, BBL, <laughs> hot looking hands. Listen, I will not take away the fact that they look good. Of course, yeah. You so did now, say. yeah, it comes to the part where we have to dance. I'm like, ah, no, nah, so why would they? Yeah, let's get in there. Ah, those girls just started bending. <laughs> Guys, I really wish you could see what I'm doing. God, they were just bending like this. <laughs> and that's the whole. The BBLs don't shake, guys. They don't, huh? BBL does not shake. It's just there. BBL don't shake. BBL don't shake. It don't make a movement. Because there's that shake, man, that you need on a butt. You need, you know? a, you need a little bit of a... Yeah, yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah, like, yeah. you're in Africa, baby. You, you really need to I mean? see that movement. You know, you know what I mean? mean? And these were London-based kind of babes. Yeah. Most of them because it was... Yo, the whole diaspora had come to Ghana in December. I want to be like, right, right. everybody was there. But BBL about the mama shake. In case you didn't know, BBL shake. But go get it. You'll look you know, hot. do your thing. Do your, do your thing. thing. Yeah. Ten fifty one is your time. In case you just tuned in, Loster is in the building. Lorato Ora Ora is in the building. I was like, yo, what's going on? Yeah. But she's in the building. Media personality, influencer, producer, film and television, radio too. And we're playing a little game we call celebrities and the music. They like And uh, the next following question is obviously Do you feel like you're a celebrity in B-Dub? Do I feel like I'm a celebrity? Yeah, because maybe TK just invited people That yeah. people don't know Yeah. So let's hear it from you How do you um, I think I'm a superstar there I've always go. been destined for greatness Uh-oh. It's one of those things that I've always had a passion in So yeah. celebrity status All depends on what people say That's their perspective, perspective. But yeah. the point is If you're doing the work That a celebrity does Then what do you consider me as? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You get what I mean? I had a conversation with Tato Rampedi The other yeah. time And I called me a celebrity He's like You know what? Rather call me a well-known YouTuber Yeah You know what I mean? So yeah. for you two would, would we rather say Well-known media personality influencer? Call me celebrity Call me superstar <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm talking about 1052 is your time And for your selection Losto Yeah You went Afro beats. Yes. Before we press play. Yes. Tell my your people 
Why now? Why Afro beats now? Guys, I think the most beautiful thing about um, Afro beat is that they've embraced being African ah, and they've yeah. taken the African culture to the world. That's right. And that's what I really truly love and appreciate about Afro beats for that's me right. personally. And it's good music, man. You get to enjoy it, you get to bump into your favorite artists and just it's for me it's the culture more than anything. It's culture. so rich. It's culture. It's rich. And I think when you're the most authentic about yourself, yes. then you're able to influence the whole world. Look Absolutely. at what Afro beats has done to the exactly. whole world. Exactly. Collaborations with Kid, and Chris Brown. Even, you know what I mean? Drake yeah. is trying to jump Drake on that. Coming. It's it's crazy. It's amazing. Yeah. All right, so what they have to do on 14962 Losto. Yeah. They get to SMS me and be very very brutal with their truth yeah and tell us if your playlist is juicy or a miss mm, <laughs> <laughs> no but i'm excited let's you do that it? all right yeah. let's get into it brand new feature alert it's called celebrities and the music they like and all you have to do the one job early this morning as soon as you wake up is to tell us ah uh, your guest music really sucks <laughs> or ah uh, your guest music really pops man and it's fire so for the first song Ruga or Ruja? Ruja. Ruja. Oh, Ruga. Oh, Ruga. <laughs> I'm not too confident as well, but you, the, the spelling is R-U-G-E-R. So exactly. Ruga, Ruja. All right, please yeah. introduce your song because it's coming out first. The first song that we're going to be playing for you today is by the man himself. Um, it's called <laughs> Ruja. His name is Ruja and the song is called Asiwaju. Asiwaju. Please so. There we go. You're on the Juice 2.0 hashtag Celebrities and the music they love 14962 SMS line All you gotta do is let me know exactly how you feel about Her selection of music Her name is Losto And the first track Asiwaju Ruja And you all got you just You know Juicy or Miss Juicy or Miss For your WhatsApp Triple da, Plus 267 rather uh, 69269 Triple Yo Plus 267 39569 There it is There it is all right, so we got a juicy here. Someone says it's juicy. We got a juicy already. Yep, yep. That person understands what's going on in the world. They know the yeah. What's yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, it's Afro Beats. It's Ruja. Who else are you popping Afro Beats? Apart from the people that you've already sent me. Uh, oh, on my list. Yep. Ooh, it's quite a number of people. Did I send you extra Little John? You really did, yeah. I did. I send you. There's one that I really love. He's a classic. Um, uh -huh. His name is Little Cash. Little Cash. Oh, there's this song called Is It Because I Love You? Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. I used to go crazy over that song. So, Little Cash. Um, there's quite, quite a number of guys, though. That is, yeah. Um, what's his name? Hey, but you know these people have hard names as well. Of course, of course. Um, Ruja. Uh -huh. Okay. Little Cash. Uh huh. That's this guy's name. I want to Are remember you, it. I don't want to mess it up for you. Is it like Rema's? Your, no, not Rema. Rema's? It's it's the guys who are... You know, my introduction to Nigerian music yes. was with the guys who did hard, hard Nigerian music. You okay, know what I mean? Okay. The guys that were introduced by Davido. Ah, um, your Olamide. Olamide. Your... Um, you know, I really want to remember this guy because I like him a lot. Okay. Can um, I remember him after this yeah, song? Definitely, yeah, definitely, definitely. All right, so 11 is your time, top of the hour, and we're still moving right along into the last hour of the Juice 2.0, giving you nothing but you, you know, the music that you love, and it's courtesy of the celebrity in the building. Her name is Losto. Look, speaking of music, Losto. Yeah. What's the one song that describes how you feel about the man that you're talking to right now? <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the Juice Oh Portal. my word What song can I define The situation as <laughs> Situation <laughs> Yeah It's gotta be a song Oh my word I've never even thought about it To that oh, yeah? extent Hey Okay But I'd I'd, I'd, I'd like to place uh, My woman my everything. Let's go out of my woman. No, I I go buy you anything. Hey, that's that's the that's the theme of my life. No, I feel you on that one though. Uh, my woman is by who? If you know your music, um, Patron Ranking. Patron Ranking. I thought you were gonna say something else. No, 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 Ranking. You really know your music in it. Let's play that song because that's how you really feel about you know. Uh, yo, you know. <laughs> Where is it? Where is it? Patavan King. Do I have it? Not this one. It? Okay. Where is it? Shucks, man. Okay. We might have to look for it. And uh, we don't have my woman in my system. My everything. Now, you know what? Because cause I know exactly how you feel about that track. Right? Yeah. Yeah. I know exactly how you feel because... I, I, I start feeling the same way about, you know, 
<laughs> it's a beautiful song. It's a beautiful song. It's a beautiful song. I think the lyrics for me just do it. It's you know, um, Mr. Yeezy is always talking. Mr. Yeezy advocates for love. Mr. Sorry, Patron King Pat and Ron Mr. Yeezy as well. Yeah. You know, I was like, I like Mr. Yeezy and Patron King, yeah. but they always advocate for love. You know, West African men always want to make their women feel like they're powerful. You know, I like that. Yeah, and is it just West African men. How how do we have it down here in Southern Africa? In terms of well. Mm, it's kind of different <laughs> It is kind of different Shame I think we're more of well, I was just having a conversation Actually funny enough With a friend of mine And we are talking about How I think Men on this side of Africa Southern Africa Are mm-hmm. kind of westernized Do you know what I mean ah. And western lifestyle Is normally 50-50 50-50 In relationships yeah, You know yeah. You do your chores I do my chores yeah. And we keep it moving And then in West Africa It's more like a I got you I got you Yeah. You just gotta show up Man, allow me to catch you. What I want to be though, that's what, exactly yeah. what I want to be. You want to be a, I want to catch. I want to be like, yo, hey, please do that. You don't got to be, you know. You don't got to be struggling. You don't got to be fighting. Girl, girl, I, girl you. I want you to live your best life, yeah. but I also got you. You know what I mean? Say less. Per. Say less. Back up. I just remember the artist that I wanted to mention. Who is that? His name is Latan. I don't even know who yeah. that is. Yo, I, Latan is one of those major guys who goes, I don't know what they call the the i is it, it's not island boys it's the guys who live in the in lagos but like deep in lagos who just ah. create this people i feel like they're the originators of the culture okay. and then it just starts to flourish and comes into different and layers it becomes commercial yes it becomes well. yes those okay. are the type of guys who originated but now he's commercial um i don't know how you don't know Zlatan. Zlatan. So is it spelled l a t a n no it's spelled z l a T E N. So it's Zla. Zlatan. Zlatan. I think I've heard of this guy before. Yeah. Zlatan. Okay, we'll check out what kind of music he has. Do you have a specific one that you? Um, Bolale. Bolale. Bolanli. Bolanli. Yes. Okay, I'll check it out and play it for you. See if it's juicy or a miss. But we've already started with Ruja. Let's check out what else you have. Next up, we've got um, Ashake with a song called um, Peace Be Unto You. <laughs> Ashake is major. Ashake is proper. Ah! Ashake dude. is the next burner boy for me. Ashake is the truth. Ashake is the I'm, Yoruba. I'm not sure if he's the next burner boy because burner boy is, I don't know, man. Burner boy is huge, but I think he's well in the right direction in terms oh, yeah. of he- reaching that superstar right. global status. Right. If he does things right, trust me. Has, has Whiskey fallen off? <laughs> I don't even have any song that I'm feeling from Wizkid from at the Wiz, moment. Yeah, yeah. I think Wizkid, because I discovered him in about in 2015, and I've met Wizkid before, you know? Oh, you have? Twice, yes. Wow. I've met him. The first Your time life. I met him was in Joburg. Uh-huh. I met a nightclub, and that was before he became Wizkid, Wizkid. It was the time when he just released, um, what's that song? Uh, Ol- yes, it was just when he just released Ola Fire. And then I met him again when he came to Botswana for Dope. the concert that he had with Burner Boy. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Dope. The empty one? Huh? The empty concert? Uh uh-uh, uh, please, can we not talk about the crowd? We're talking about the artist. <laughs> There's too much heat in this room. There's too much heat in this room, man. Ashake is coming up next, but not before I ask you a question about your life, mm. Loshto. If you were to write a song about yeah. your life, what would you title it? Not nothing, Madam Chop Life. Please. Okay. No, no, no. I mean, I've been through a lot, guys. You know, there's a point where Madam Chop Life almost died. Um, oh, not died like me in the actual because okay. I, I well, Madam, Madam Chop Life is a character it's in a character. my life. Yeah, yeah. Um, there's Madam Chop Life, there's Losto, there's the Hrut Lady, and yeah. then there's Lorato. Dope, dope. So dope. those are all different people with different chapters. So I right. think every every part of my book would have a chapter based on my nicknames mm. or a name that I've named myself. Mm. Of course. Um, because I come up with these names or I, I'm given these names based on the stage I am at in yeah. my life. Yeah. Um, but if I were to write a book, yeah. I'd probably name it Phases. Phases. Yeah. I, I don't know. I can't think sounds of anything, dope. but that it would be dope. Phases because I'd be speaking about different parts of my life. I'd listen to that song. I'd definitely read that book, Phases, because yeah. which phase do you feel has been the best for you? I mean, uh, are you able to tell us how old you are right now? Yeah, yeah for sure. How, how I'm 26. 26. Yeah, I'm going on 27 on the 31st of May. You better buy a gift. Hey, 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 <laughs> hey, 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 hey. <laughs> I got you though. Yeah. But yeah, t- tell me about phases up to 26, yeah. 27. Which one would you say has been the best phase? 
Um, my favorite phase was Madame Chop Life. <laughs> it still is. It's my number one. It's my favorite yes. phase of my life. Uh-huh. But growing up, Losto was my favorite phase because that's when I kind of discovered who I truly am. Oh, yeah. um, I started hanging out with people who allowed me to be myself, you know? Go, go. Growing up, I was kind of shy. I oh, was, yeah? Uh, yeah, I was kind of shy. Hard like, to believe. Very shy. Yeah. Shame. I won't even lie. I was very shy, but I was myself at home. Of course. Yeah. But when I get to school, I'm just a shy girl. And then when I got to high school, I started hanging out with the cool kids. Cool kids. And I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> but this is Blessing Sister. That's what people used to call me Blessing Sister. Now I started having my own identity. Right, right. And my best friend named me Lo Sto. Dope. At the time, she's like, ah, Sto mean, meant best friend. And then Lo was the first part of my Morato, name. Yeah, 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 so it was like Lo Sto. So my Lo creative, Sto. Creative, yeah, creative. so then I'm like, I like their name. It sounds cool. It's Everybody's, beautiful. yeah. Lo Sto. Who's yeah. your best friend? I have my current best friend right now is Mrs. Marata. Miss Marata. Jamie. So what's That's, going on, Jamie? Jamie, I hope you're <laughs> listening, baby. Because, cha. You know. But my best friend that named me Losto yeah. is Laone Mudukanele. Big shout out going out to Laone. 11 13 is your time. Let's get to Ashake. You chose the song. Asylum. Hey. I like a. Hey, hey, are, hey. I get to plenty, plenty disciples. Hey. <laughs> And her name is Losto On the feature on the show That is celebrities and the music they like We've already gone super super West Africa man We started with Ruja, with Ruja. We went My Woman with Pato Ranke We're now with Ashake Peace be unto you One of my favorite tracks And it goes deep and hard When it drops in the club yeah? Yep Yep And the poet goes Are asalam Hey, I like go. Hey, I get to make like it goes. Hey, guys, I lose my mind. What is your go-to twerk song at a club? Um, do I twerk? <laughs> um, what what song? I think you can twerk to anything. You can twerk to anything. But you know, you, you know that song that ooh, Snoop Dogg. Yeah, yeah, it like it's hot. It's a forever. That one, if you and then yeah, and then don't stop, don't stop, don't stop. <laughs> yeah, that's that. That's our fire song. Oh, well. the ladies go crazy with that. Yeah. All right, talk to us. We're about to wrap it up actually with a few more tracks with Lost Show hashtag celebrities and the music they like. You're on the Juice 2.0. In case you're just waking up, I, I don't know what, what what's wrong with you though. We start at nine and we end at twelve. Look at what the time is. All right, okay, I won't go so hard. But tomorrow, same time, same place. We get to rock for three hours. Trust me, this is what you need for your weekend. This is what you need to get juiced up and get you ready for a brand new weekend. And weekends are better on the Juice 2.0. I appreciate you so much. If you've been with me since 9, it's great gabs of programming. All right, all right. 11.17, Losto is in the building. Losto. Yeah, yeah. Talk to me, what's up? Who is your celebrity crush in B-Dub? In Botswana. In Botswana. Hey, guys, to be honest, I'm going to say this. I'm not on the list, by the way, so... <laughs> You're not allowed to be on the Never list. Never get old. <laughs> um, I think Vizo is hot. Yeah. Vizo is... Yeah. You know why I just went quiet? Why did you go quiet? Because I don't know what's going on. Yeah. But all my episodes... Yeah. All my episodes... It's been Vizo. On YouTube. Yeah. And I'm just talking to a young girl, talking about who's your celebrity crush, what the... But Vizo View... Vizo View is the man of the moment. I won't even lie. That guy is good looking. He's got the, he, you know, he knows how to rap. He's yeah. talented. Yeah. Like he's like a nice little package. You know what I yeah. mean? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what's going on with Vizo. Hey, yo, Vizo. Bro, I don't know. He's, he's a good friend of mine. So I think I need to start moving with him wherever he goes. I told him this the last time. Yeah. I was like, homie, you know what? I know you got friends. And Vizo is a nice person. I think such a, because he's, such he's a, a kind dude. Such a dope yeah. person. Very considerate, mm-hmm. you know. You would think as a rapper, there's all the you know the chip on uh, mm-hmm. but it's not with Vizo. Not with Vizo. Who else? Who else is there? Is there someone else? I think D Bond is cute. D Bond, yeah, yeah. I think D Bond is cute. FME, what's going on, yo? <laughs> what's happening? <laughs> I think D Bond is cute. I heard you had a thing with O'Neill. Is that true? Who me? Yeah, I wish they lie. Yeah. <laughs> It's I not wish. true. It's not true. It's not true. It was just a picture, but we look good together, right? It makes sense. Ah, oh, it must have been. Yeah, but picture. it makes sense because I don't blame you. <laughs> I've been there too. <laughs> what else you got for us, man? We haven't played Patek, Mr. Easy. We haven't played Lil John. So okay. we only we only need two tracks, yeah. Okay. Uh, should that do it? That's gonna be. Love is wicked is on it as well. So let's get on my list. Track. On your yeah. You send me love is wicked. 
Did I send you live this weekend? No. Let me, let me confirm. Let me confirm. Hold that. on. <laughs> yeah, wait. Hold on. Ready, pro. What's going on? Hold on. I sent you Rich Till I Die. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah. Extra cool. No, this weekend is not there. Attack and a bonus track, Bandana. So, you want Bandana right now? Let's hit Bandana right now. Bandana right now? Are lucky. Uh-huh. Oh, my guys, them, them. Okay, play the song. All right. I was about to ask you who sang that song, and let's just let them sing it because. Okay. Jeez, lost <laughs> yeah, from Party Engage Row. What a lovely track, man. What a jam. Bandana. This track is just an amazing track. Asaki is also on it. And uh, obviously, because we're Afro Beatty this morning, courtesy of Losto, who selected this tracks and it's the celebrities and the music they like. Let us know if it's juicy or a miss. You're very, very welcome to do that. Don't hesitate. Don't be scared, actually. Just drop it however you feel it in your heart. And you're like, you know what? Nah, that was just a miss. But maybe that was such a gem. And this song should have made it to our TikTok feature uh not the tiktok feature should have made it to the first feature where i told you you and i are gonna have the juice box where you can just have themed music and today's yeah. theme was from tiktok music are you big on tiktok i love tiktok i've got thirty-four thousand followers on tiktok oh that's dope yeah that's tiktok dope. is a growing community i think it's it's fast-paced it's yeah. fun you yeah. can be yourself you can do anything you want it's unlike instagram where you have to be really curated yeah yeah twitter i'm not a big fan of twitter i no. don't like to voice out my opinion facebook Facebook uh, on 8.7. Uh-huh. Not too bad. I, I come there once in a while. Of course. To find out what's going on. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Instagram, that's my favorite place to be in TikTok. Lovely. Only fans? <laughs> Not yet. <laughs> 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 I see what you did there. Uh, no shame. I don't have only fans. <laughs> It's not legal in Botswana. It's not legal in Botswana. <laughs> <laughs> I need that. I think, uh, how would you, if ever, hypothetically, yeah. you were to go on Only Fans, how do you think you would fare? How would I? Fair. Would you do good? I would definitely do good. Yeah? Def- like, that is no doubt. Yeah. Even some of the people that comment on my pictures, I know where the comments are. <laughs> so I know I'll do really well. Um, but unfortunately, I would never do an OnlyFans. Yeah. Well, mm-hmm. same. 11.24 is your time. Losto, I've always been wondering, because you have a nice set over there. Mm. Can I... You. Yeah. TK. Yeah. Your girlfriend is... <laughs> <laughs> never. Never. <laughs> Hey, Lofsto, come on. TK, please. Okay, better question. Better question. Don't even say Viso. <laughs> Don't, please, because no. Okay, another better question. <laughs> O'Neal? Oh, he can, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Look, but I think guys are always on that tip, right? When they approach you. That is the first thing first that thing. they speak about. Like, oh, you know... That's like, yeah, I know. <laughs> you know. <laughs> you know. Like, you know. Tell me something I don't know. Yeah. Best feature on your body? Favorite my feature eyes. on your body? Your eyes. Yeah, I've got very beautiful big eyes. You do. And I love my ears. Those oh, are, yeah. I don't know. I lo- There's something about eyes and ears for me. Yeah. Like when I meet a person, I look at their eyes, ears, and their, and ears. their nose. Uh-huh. Top three. That's it. That's it. Okay. Yeah. I and love I'm it. Like, mm, that's a nice nose. <laughs> that's some nice ears. Low store. We're about to wrap up, but... This is a question that I've asked all my guests in the recent times because yeah. I want to be human about it. I want to just tap into exactly what you really feel about life mm-hmm. and your desires and your heart, really. So the question is, what do you want out of life? Well, the first quote that I live by is, slowly is the fastest way to get there. Dope. Um, so what I want out of life is success, yeah. happiness, right. and peace. Right. And to drop life. <laughs> <laughs> of course. Success. Happiness, happiness, peace, peace, chop life, chop life. That's it. I said, I'm not asking for too much. I, I wish, I wish all of that for you. Thank you so much. We're about to let you go, but you spoke about Lil John. Why this track extra cool? Ah, <sighs> this song is one of those songs. I heard it at the club as well. All these songs <laughs> I'm hearing in the club, and I just started enjoying it. It's a nice song. Yeah, it's it's got its own vibe. It's got its own rhythm. It's a nice song. That's uh-huh. all I can say. Really, it's. It's, it's got a bit of also London. I think it's a, it's got a little bit of a London touch, but yeah, yeah. it's West African. I love it. It's Afrobeat. On Instagram, you are? Lorato underscore Orapeling. On Twitter, you are? Lorato underscore Orapeling. On Facebook, you are? Lorato Orapeling. <laughs> What's happening the rest of the weekend? Tell me. Um, I'm just going to be home. Uh-huh. I'm going to be spending some time with my family. Uh, I might step out two munchies later. We'll uh-huh. see. Uh-huh. Um, but 
for now I'm going to be home with my family I'm going to babysit a couple of kids right now <laughs> I would have loved them to come with me to experience the radio that would have been dope yeah, yeah, yeah shame but like they were tired right, said, right. Let, let them rest let the kids rest um, but yeah that's about it for my weekend I just can't wait for next week to post on what's coming up Oof, yeah. I cannot wait anticipation roof level but I appreciate you so so pleased in my heart to meet you thank you so much Extremely. Tiki for inviting me I am grateful I'm blessed and God bless you God bless you <laughs> That's it. Check her out on her Instagram, on her socials, everywhere. She is Losto. She is Madam Chop Life. Just like that, we give you Losto. What an amazing celebrities and the music they like. And if you ask me if the music is juicy or a miss, I only have one thing to say. Juicy. Juicy. All right. So to wrap it all up is one last track that she requested. And it's track titled Extra Cool. But it's your boy, yeah, yeah, Lou Joyen. What's going on, YouTube? My name is TK of the Juice 2.0. I'm just here to say thank you very much for checking our video and click subscribe, like, and the notification button for more content just like that.